Hello, guys. Hello, hello. Good evening. Good evening. Hello. Hello, guys. Can you can you hear me? I can hear you. Ah, all right. All right. Perfect. Good evening. Okay. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Hey, hello. Now is working your microphone, right, there, Ivan? Yes, uh, my microphone doesn't work. Yesterday, after you travel with your computer, I oh. don't know what happened. I don't know what happened. No, no pude. No, no, no. Oh. Bloqueado el, the microphone. Yeah, sometimes yeah, that yeah. happens. That yes, happens. Yes, yes. But now you are here. Perfect. Very good. Yes, I'm here. Okay. Excellent. Excellent. Okay. Hello, guys. Uh, hello, Jorge. Great to see you. Okay. Online. Great seeing you. Good evening. Good evening, uh, Carla Rene. Hello. Good evening, uh, Hello. How are you doing, guys? Uh, Wendy Paola. Welcome. Good evening. Uh, Luis Eduardo Mendez. Good okay. evening, teacher. Hey, hello, good evening, guys. How was your Wednesday at work in your general activities? Was it normal? Was it good? How was your Wednesday? Normal? Working Wednesday? Very busy. Busy, a lot of activities. Yeah, right? a lot of activity all the day. All right, full of activities. Okay, but now it's time for your class. Welcome, guys, and thank you for joining. Let me share the screen with you right away in this moment. Please, can you confirm that you see this nice picture that is an island connecting with a bridge on the ocean? You see the picture? Yeah? Beautiful, beautiful. Okay, perfect. All right. All right, guys. Welcome one more time to your class okay today uh, we are going to begin with the class number three pre-advanced model one you know the indications your name in the platform of zoom your camera if you have a camera use it please and uh, remember uh, to have active your camera all the session uh, connect uh, punctually five minutes early before your class and be attentive uh, please avoid distractions avoid the tv the cell phone instagram twitter facebook etc okay and remember your participation is a lot important in the class and remember work on the online platform about your assignments of this week okay perfect and remember you can make questions you can make any type of questions whenever you have doubts during the class. Okay, in the four areas that we practice, speaking, listening, the grammar, we check grammar as well, and we try to practice. Okay, the tools, have you tried uh, the tools? Have you used them? Have you explored them? Uh -huh. Yes, teacher. Okay, what do you think about those tools? It's very good because uh, I I'm gonna find I can find several words. Okay, yeah, it's pretty useful. Please. Use it. Use it, please. Yes. It will it will improve your your English yeah. in grammar. Pronounce check. You can check a pronunciation there as well. Hey, I see Sophia taking notes. Hello, Sophie. Welcome, Anna Ivania. Welcome as well, Catherine. There she is, Luis Carranza. Welcome, guys. Okay, let's see. Pre advanced on model one. Let's get into the topic that we are going to study today. Okay, please, uh, Sophia, can you, can you help me with the reading about this first topic? Sophia? Okay, best job according with your personality. Okay, thank you. Thank you, Sophie. Best jobs according with your personality type. Okay, in the picture, the job is... What's the job? Pilot. Pilot. Pilot, correct. 
pilot. That is a pretty nice job. You can go everywhere. You can visit countries, etc. Okay, pilot. And question on the screen, what, can you read it? Can you read the question, please? What's your current job? Oh, my current job is a um, graphic designer and uh, a teacher. So I have two. I have two jobs. My current job is a graphic designer and a teacher. Uh, and you, uh, Jorge, what's your, your current job in this moment? I'm self-person teacher. Okay, you are a salesperson. What about you, uh, Ivania? What's your current job? What do you do? Uh, take the microphone, activate it, please. Okay. Um, I am um, a bank employer. Ah, okay, bank, bank employer. Yeah. But an employer is a person who gives you the job. Maybe you meant employee. Okay, I am is uh, uh, I am a chief a uh, chief of branch. Oh, okay, that is better. You are a chief of branch. Oh, okay, all right. Uh, oh, oh. Yes, just this is the, the exactly. Okay, but branch office bank. You work in a branch office of a bank. Uh, exactly. All right. Okay, branch office is a, an office that is in any place. Okay, perfect. Okay. Good, good. Alejandra, what's your current job in this moment? What do you do? My current job is a compliance officer. It's about... Uh, Anti-money laundering, the legislation, oh. the local legislation in, in, in El Salvador, and Mercedes-Benz. Oh, Mercedes-Benz, the cars company? Yes. Oh, that's uh, interesting. Do you have a Mercedes-Benz car? Not yet. <laughs> uh, okay, but you work where you see cars, Mercedes. Okay, pretty cool. Okay, Buena Paola? Uh, what's your job, Wendy? What do you do for living? What do you do? Paola? Wendy Paola? Melissa? Sofia? Uh -huh, guys, tell me about your jobs. What do you do in your everyday life? I'm a housewife and I take care of my son, son homework. And I'm looking for a job, teacher. All right, that's cool. That's cool. But housewife is the most difficult job in the world. Yes, it is difficult. Okay, hey, Romeo, and you? What do you do? What's your current job? Hi, teacher. Um, really, my current job is a lawyer. Uh, is a lawyer in the in the morning, and in, in my office, and in the afternoon. I am music teacher. <laughs> All right. Do you have two jobs? Music yeah. Music teacher and lawyer. Yes. Cool, cool, cool. Ivan, what about you? Your current job? Um, teacher, I am a, I'm a teacher of computer and sport coach and in my church with a Centro de Desarrollo Integral CDI. I have a, I have a several a childrens in my class every oh, day. Okay. All right, perfect, very good. Francisco Antonio, your current job? Hi, teacher. Hi. I am technical collaborator in the um, electrical area. Oh, okay, okay, very cool. Good job, good job. Catherine, Beatriz, Luis Eduardo, Julio Cesar. Hi, teacher. Hello. I am a lawyer and um, immigration advisor. Ah, immigration advisor, but lawyer. 
Yes. Okay, that's cool. Okay, you can you help with uh, you help people with a visa? Yes. Oh, I uh, need I need a visa. <laughs> yes, yes. Um, I need it. Okay. Uh, bueno, en español, soy asesor y vendo boletos aéreos. Ah, okay. You you assist in in airports. You sell airplanes tickets, right? Yes. Okay. Very good. Okay. With an airplane company, you sell tickets. Okay. Perfect. Good. Good. Beatriz. Yes. I am kindergarten teacher. Better. Oh. <laughs> But, but I work technical assistant for human research. Uh, resources. Resources. Okay. Okay. Kindergarten difficult. <laughs> difficult job. Yeah. No, it's funny. Okay. <laughs> for you. All right. Okay. But it's nice. Julio Cesar, Luis Eduardo, what about you? Your jobs? Me, teacher. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. Uh, I I am a dentist, but I do medical administrator and consult many session of of violence, um, violence um against the women, uh children, adults, and that's all. Okay, okay. You work against the violence with uh, different groups. Yeah. Okay. All right. That's, That's cool. That's cool. Perfect, guys. Okay. Now I know a little bit about your your current jobs. Okay. Very good. Let's see. What activities do you do there? Tell me at least one activity that you do in your job. For example, look at my examples. Because I am a graphic designer and a teacher. Uh, my activity, for example, is I work designing using the computer and uh, teaching English, like in this moment, English classes, because I have two. Okay, or you can say, I use a computer very often. I design using the computer, etc. in my case. What about you? What activities do you perform at your job? What activities? Activities? in your job. Anyone, anybody? Sofia maybe, Ana Ivania. One activity, check. Simple present tense, simple present tense. All right. I work washing, clo washing clothes and dishes. Okay, you, Sofia works washing clothes and dishes, you said. Right, okay. Yes. All right, okay, good, very good. I work, very good. What else, who else? What do you do in your jobs? What activities do you perform in the whole day, etc.? Okay, no activities? <laughs> you you have turn. a job and no activities, uh-huh. <laughs> uh, All right. Uh, I, I work. Uh, implementing the local legislation about anti-money laundering in Mercedes-Benz and do a diligence uh, for um, ¿Cómo se dice nuestros? Our, our. For our clients. Okay. Sounds kind of full of responsibility, right? Yes. Yes. It is. Okay, very good. Anybody else? Okay. Hmm? okay. Um, me. Oh. me. Okay. and then Luis Carranza. Okay. I search uh, the business of, of the bank and I, um, how do you say, assessorar? Oh, mm, assessorar, assessor, assessor. manage, I guess that is, that can be managed. Okay. Manage, mm -hmm. manage. Yes. I I manage the, the clients of the bank, uh, and I administ 
I, I, I have a administration of branch, the uh, uh, operations and a client, uh, a customer service. Okay, pretty cool, pretty cool. Okay, thank you, excellent. Okay. Luis. Um, I'm a um, quality and training coordinator in the call center. Um, I work organizing the new training groups and um, my word is uh, make sure that the quality of the account close every month on target. Ah, okay, I know about it. I worked in several, in several call centers in the past. Okay, quality, okay, good, good, good. Perfect. Okay, one more, one more, one more, before we can All right, uh, Francisco, yeah. yes. And then Romeo, last two. Yes, Francisco, what do you do? Activities. Okay, teacher, thank you. Uh, I work designing electrical plants and uh, I program uh, activities of the, the operating person. All right, okay, very good. You program like uh, the like the location where people is gonna are gonna work in the plant. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. The the several years. Okay. Cool. Yeah. Romeo. Yes. Yes, teacher. In my office, I do legal documents such as real uh, estate purchase or leasing contracts, for example. Uh -huh. okay. Um. On at the afternoon, I teach young people how to play the violin and viola. <laughs> Okay, violin and viola. What about the guitar? No, don't you teach about guitar? No, I don't like. No. Ah, guitar. okay, you don't like the guitar. Yes. Okay, yeah. <laughs> okay, that's it. Good, good. Ivan, teacher, in my job, I work teaching computing, like Excel, PowerPoint, and Word, and in sports like chess basketball, soccer, ping pong, yes. Okay, I can't play That's... chess, it's difficult for me. Okay. I like it chess, I like it chess. I, I find chess. it difficult, I find it difficult. Okay, Carla. I'm going to teach you. <laughs> Great. Carla, yeah. Hi, teacher. In my case, I am an administrative assistant. I make and process administrative documents for all departments if they need it. Another work task for me is I receive and make invoices. Oh, okay, very good. Excellent. Make invoices, etc. Very good. Guys, excellent. Very good. You are good using the simple present tense. I like it. Make it true. Okay, cool. go ahead. Yes, no problem. Okay, I, I work uh, create. Um, I work on job team, a conference a, for doctors, nurses, and other top administrators. Okay, sounds kind of, I don't know, kind of difficult. Is it? It is. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Uh, it's like a training about how to, to, to treat uh, big, uh, violence victims. Uh, at the hospital, uh, at the Unidad de Salud, and all those places that we we are working with the, with those victims. Okay, yeah, that is a, a good activity that you do in your job, and try to help people who has people who have suffered of violence. Yes. Okay. Thank you for sharing, Catherine. Yes. We hear you. <laughs> Hello, teacher. Hello. Uh, well, in my case, I don't work. <laughs> How about um, you do activities? Uh, you do activities. Uh -huh. I am a student and I study international marketing at the university. And I use the computer for my homeworks in my classes. <laughs> it's my activity. <laughs> okay. Okay. Pretty cool. Okay, excellent, nice, nice. Thank you guys, very good, very good. Okay, 
So, in this part, say the correct job type according with the picture. It's not complicated, so we are gonna check this in this model. Okay, I'm gonna open the, what number would you like to open first? Which one, which one? Number seven. Seven, seven. I heard seven first. What is that job? Um, mandatory, present. Two options only. Eight. Okay. Uh, but uh, how do you practice the word? Practice the word? Politician. 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 All right, let's see if you are right. Ah, correct. That is the job. Good, good. Next number, please. Next one. Number five. Five. Okay. What is uh, the job? Look at the words. Content planner, blog editor, freelance blogger, proof reader, blog consultant. Project manager. Freelance, freelance manager journalist. Paper. Okay. Project manager or freelance journalist? Freelance journalist. Freelance, uh, freelance journalist. Freelance, freelance journalist. Okay, okay, let's see. Yes, that was the one. Correct. Very good. Nice. Next. Very good that you scan the picture. Okay, you don't try to guess, you check. Next, next, next one. Number 10. 10, 10, 10, 10. 10. Number 10. Ah, pretty easy. Mm. Software, software, software. Software. software developer, software developer, software developer, developer. 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 Yes, yeah. software developer. Letter A, let's Ooh. see. Correct, nice, nice. Good, good. Next, next box. Number one. One. All right. Okay. No. A or B. Computer. Computer A. A. Computer, A. Technician. Computer technician. Computer technician or? Computer technician. Sure? Computer technician. Okay, let's check it yes, out. Yes, I'm sure. Yes, of course, right? Very good. Technician. That is the word. Next box. Next box. 11. 11. Uh, okay. We have a weird picture. Marketing director. Marketing director. Marketing director. Okay, let's see. Yeah, correct. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Next, next. Three. 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 Uh huh. Guidance counselor. Okay, guidance, guidance counselor. Counselor. Yes. Guidance counselor. Guidance counselor. Okay, okay, let's see. Very good, that is a job. Nice. The next one. Nine. Nine. Next profession or job. Ah, what's that? <laughs> the tester. Wait, nice. wait, wait. Tester. I want it. I, I, I want it. <laughs> I want that job. Good job. <laughs> good job. Very Great good. job, teacher. Bed. Okay. Yeah, it is pretty Bed cool. Tester. Bed tester. Correct. Okay, look at using a suit. Okay, pretty curious. Before. Four. Uh huh. Slider. Really? Slider. <laughs> Slider. But, uh -huh. but when you say when you see the word tester, you Maybe. are using a product. You are checking Light how tester. the product Maybe. works. Is light Yeah, wow. she's, she's using the slide <laughs> to see if it's good. <laughs> if it gives you I fun. want that, that job. Pretty interesting and entertaining. Okay, next. Yeah. Number, next one, two. Next one. Number two. Two, two. Two. Oh, difficult job. Right? Break 
layer. Layers or brick layer. Brick layer. Brick layer. Brick layer. Brick layer. Ah, very good. Correct. That's it. Yes. That's it. Okay, we have only two. Eight. 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 What about this one? Okay, that is the one. Okay, and six, five, the last. Right? last one. Yeah. Weather. 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 The weather. No, no. it's not raining. No, Weather. No, Ah, welder, welder. I hear weather. I hear weather. Okay, welder. Correct. Very good. Weather. Yes, welder, welder. Okay, guys, thank you. Thank you for participating in this mini game. Okay, now we are going to continue with the next part. Um, what to find? Want to find a job that fits your personality? That is for you to do at home. Please, you can check this link. In this link, you can learn many words. Uh, you can check it out. This is how to find like your dream job, for example, or the job that goes according with your personality. You click on start the assessment. Check. You click on it. Can you read the first the first word? Would you like to? Okay, can you read it, guys? Would you like to? Would you like to advise organization on how to their business grow? Okay. How would you do that job? You would hate it, you dislike it. Neutral is like zero. You would like it or you would love it. Advise organizations on how to meet their business goals. Mm -hmm. What would you choose? Advise organizations on how to meet their business goals. Yes. Which one would you choose? No, I hate it. I wouldn't like it. I dislike it. No, not for me. Okay, maybe you like it. You choose? I like, like it. Okay, you like it and then you continue to the next one. Analyze. There is, please, uh, there is, sorry guys, there is someone speaking at the background. Could you deactivate the microphone, please? Hello? Okay, thank you. Thank you, Ivan. Thank you so much. Okay, analyze. Can you read it? Would you like to? Analyze data using a statistic. Okay, that sounds like boring. What would you say? Hate it? No. no. No, right. Not boring. Like I like it. Boring. Ah, okay, but that is you. So <laughs> like, like it. You, you like would it. like it, maybe. That is uh, depending on your personality. Okay, but you are gonna do it in a free time just to check and what is your maybe your job according with your own personality. But this is like a practice for you guys. Okay, the link about the website is in the presentation. So don't worry. Okay, I'm going to close it. We're going to continue to the next part. Okay, and the next part, we are going to be studying this topic. Gerons. 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 Yes. Okay. Gerons as subject and object. Yes. We are going to check how to use this in English. Please help me, Francisco, Antonio. Okay, teacher. 
What's a gerund? A base form of a verb that, that has ing. Correct. What's a gerund? A base form of any any verb that has ing. Correct. Example, what is the base form of the verb? Feel. Mm -hmm. Feel. 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 That is the base form of the verb. And the next part is? ING. And ING means? Gerald. 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 And together, we say? Feeling. Feeling. Correct. Feeling. That is a gerund, not complicated. The next one, base form. Play. 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 ING. Play. Together. Play. Playing. Playing, correct. There it is. That's it. That is a gerund. Base form of a verb with ING. Next. Okay. Uh, -da 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 -da. Luis, Luis Carranza, please. Luis, can you can uh, you hear me? Uh, subject. Mm -hmm. Structure, base form, plus ING, uh, equal gerund. Using gerund is uh, work, rest, fly, working, mm -hmm. Resting, flying. There it is. Okay, simple, right? No complication. Good. And below says, using gerunds isn't the same as the present progressive. Be careful with this. This is not, I am working. I am eating a hamburger. I am drinking water. This is not progressive. This is different. Let's see. We have the chat. Teacher, Michael. Oh, really? Oh, no, no, no. Okay. Don't worry, Alejandra. Okay. Try to reconnect to check the class. All right. Okay. Clear? Clear on that? It's not present progressive. It's different. Let's continue. Um, in this next part, help me, please, uh, Ivan. Gerald. Yes, Gerald, a subject. Okay, this is the first part. We are going to make sentences with gerunds as the subject of a sentence. Ivan. To express ideas, we can do it using. Singular idea. Okay, check. Only singular ideas, no plural. Only singular. Continue, please. What is the sentence? Smoking is a bad habit. 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 Correct. Smoking is a bad habit. What does it mean, smoking, Ivan? It's uh. El verb it's, is the subject or the sentences not acting as a verb. Okay, notice it is in the first place. This is not a verb. It is not acting as a verb. It is yes. acting as the subject of the sentence. The smoking is a bad habit. If you translate it, what is the meaning of the sentence? If you translate it. El fumar es un mal hábito. O fumar, right? O fumar, fumar. fumar, right? Es fumar. un mal hábito. Es un mal hábito. But if you try to say fumando es un mal hábito. Fumando, fumando. But fumando fumar. is present progressive. This is not present progressive. This is gerund. Gero. A gero. Gero. As a subject. As a subject. subject. Correct. Subject as a subject. Okay, let's check the next one. Uh, the next, continue even. Next sentence. Okay. Sleeping light isn't recommend, recommendable. 
recommendable. Recommendable. Recommendable. Repeat it. Recommendable. Recommendable, correct. Recommendable. That's it. Recommendable. Is sleeping late? Do you sleep late? We don't know. Is sleeping late? Check. You can make it in negative as well. Isn't. Isn't. Recommendable. What is the meaning if you translate it? What's the meaning of sleeping? Dormir tarde no es recomendable. Uh -huh. Dormir, right? No durmiendo because no, it's no not dormiendo, progress. Claro. It's a gerund. I got it. Correct. Okay? Those are the two example sentences. We are going to practice in a moment. Okay. Questions at, at this point? Questions? Am I going fast or okay? Am I going fast or okay with the explanation? Hello? Uh, teacher. It's okay. Hello? Okay. The, uh, the, the read uh, um, sleeping noise, noise, uh, 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 durmiendo. <laughs> okay. No. I, I don't understand the, the, the ruler. <laughs> Okay, the rule. Okay, the rule. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay, it's uh -huh. kind of at the beginning, you might have kind of a doubt, but when you practice, when you make sentences, ah, okay, it's not, it's not the progressive durmiendo, no. Uh -huh. Because check, it is in the first part of the sentence. But in the progressive, you need subject, the verb to be, and uh -huh. the verb in ing. I uh, what am I doing in this moment? What am I doing? What is the activity that I am doing? Teaching. Ah, but complete the complete structure. What am I doing? In this you moment? are teaching English. Correct. You are teaching English. That is progressive. But do you have a subject in this part? Do you have I, you, he, she in the first place? No. No subjects, no he, no she, no teacher, no my daughter, my mother. No, no subjects. And no verb to be like in the progressive. This is Gerald. When you see a sleeping late isn't recommendable. That is... Teacher, yeah. mm -hmm. uh, Jerome, with, with the same um, verb is teaching English is cool, for example. Ah, okay, that is a Jerome sentence, correct. Okay. Teaching is cool. Okay. If you translate it, what is the meaning? Enseñar is, is, is cool. <laughs> that's it, that's it, simple, right? Another example that you can give me with a, with a gerund as a subject. Try it out. Try. Mm -hmm. For example, um, cooking is the best activity. Ah, very good. Cooking is the best activity. Very good. You are using gerunds. Very good. Someone else? More examples? Walking is good for self. All right. Yeah, I absolutely agree. Walking is good for your health. See, you place the gerund in the first place. Okay, very good. Another one, for examples, about your activities at work. You can make them about your activities as well. Uh -huh. Teacher, uh, listening is, is um, uh, listening is uh, good for improving my English. Okay. Listening is good for improving. For improving my English. Correct. Because after prepositions, the next verb should be ing. After oh. prepositions, like for, for example. All right. Very good. That is, that is correct. Okay. Excellent. Let's see more. Let's see more about this. Gerunds a subject. What is the subject? Can you make a sentence with this animation? Drinking. Uh huh. Drinking beer is bad for our health. Correct. Drinking beer is bad for our health. 
That's it. Very good. Okay. There is. That is the gerund. Good. Next part, gerund to subjects. Okay, similar. Make a sentence. Ah, no, we don't have, you don't have to use any sentence. We have the reasons that we can use. Please help me, uh, Romeo. Can you read these sentences, please? Gerund to subjects. Okay, gerund, gerund as subject. A gerund can be the subject in a sentence. Mm -hmm. It's always singular. Use third person singular of a verb after a gerund. Okay, let's see. Let's see how is this done. Example, continue, please. Playing soccer is one of the favorite habits. Correct. What is the first part? Subject playing soccer, uh -huh. playing soccer uh, is subject of the sentence singular. Singular, see? Verb to yeah. be in singular, like in this part. It's always singular. Okay. Playing soccer is, right? Because it's only one sport. We don't have two sports like soccer. Soccer one and soccer two. Is soccer is soccer. It's only one. All right? Next yeah. example. Next one. Uh, listen, wait, wait takes time. Ah, okay. What happens in this one? In this one, um, Ivania, what happens in this one? What is the difference with this example? Playing soccer. Uh, 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 please, uh, losing. 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 Wait takes time. Time. Uh, Hmm. Check. Subject, Here it is it subject? Ah, oh, okay. Yes, Francisco. Person. Help, help your your classmates. Okay. Yeah, teacher. Uh, change the verb. In the three sentences, is the verb to be. All right. In three oh, person. Okay. Uh huh. But in the second sentence. Takes. Second sentence, uh, the verb is take, but in the the third person takes that's right that's right that is the difference third person but the third person of the verb to be but this is the third person but in the verb takes and that's it okay. and the subject of the sentence is losing weight subject of the sentence in singular okay those are two examples more let's see Indication, Thanks. please, uh, Julio Cesar. Here, teacher. Gerunds as a subject with the next picture form a sentence with a gerunds as, a, as subject. As subject. Like similar, like the previous sentences that we just wrote or mentioned. Example, first picture. What is the picture about what do you see eating eating french fries okay eating okay just let me correct it eating french fries uh it uh it is a bad habit all right okay it's a bad <laughs> habit yeah, because it's not good. If you always eat French fries in McDonald's or any restaurant, that's not good. All right. What is the sentence, uh, the subject of the sentence? It is French. Eating. Yes. Eating French, fries. Eating French fries. But French fries, fries is plural. But we are talking about the gerund as the subject. Not about the fries, even mm -hmm. though the fries is in plural in this case, but we are talking about the gerund as the subject of the sentence. Correct. It is correct. Okay. And what about in the second picture? 
Can you make a sentence? Uh, let's see, maybe Beatriz can help me out, or Romeo, or Catherine. Check. All right. Uh, writing. Let's see. Uh, writing your homework is. I don't know. I confuse. Okay. Me can you help? Can you help? Uh, help. You can yes. help. Okay. Um, I stewing is a uh, good for the uh, future so people. All right. Okay. Very good. Is studying. Can you practice the pronunciation? Is studying. Studying. Is studying is good. Starting. For the future okay. of people. Okay, the sentence is correct. Very good. See, singular, where to be. Where to be. The studying is good for the future of people. That's right. Okay, I agree. Very good example. That's it. Do we have more? More pictures? What about in this one? Maybe Francisco or Carla or Ivania. In this Next picture. Can you form a sentence using a gerund as a subject? Mm. Okay, check. Check the, the activity. Is cooking? Okay, <laughs> cooking. We begin with the gerund all the time. Cooking, studying, practicing, smoking, playing. That's it. Cooking. Negative. Try out. Uh, try it out in negative. Oh. Mm -hmm. Isn't uh, right. dangerous to I, work? No, but cooking is dangerous sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but okay, good example. <laughs> Cooking isn't um, dangerous. Okay. <laughs> ah, okay. You are missing the article. Cooking isn't a dangerous, dangerous job. job. All right. Cooking. Very good. This is the subject. Cooking isn't a dangerous job. Very good. That's it. What about in this picture? Guys, check, check it out. Check the picture. Driving, driving fast is very dangerous. Ah, okay. You are contrasting with the with the previous one. Driving, mm -hmm. driving fast, fast. You said. Next, next part. It's very dangerous. Is very. Dangerous, correct. Dangerous. Yeah, it is. Okay, you gotta be careful about driving. Driving fast is very dangerous. That's it. The sentence is correct. See, all the time we begin with a gerund. Gerund at the beginning, driving, cooking, etc. Okay, very good. Uh, questions about this part, guys? Any question? Questions? Remember, gerund a subject, ing at the beginning. Uh, studying English is very useful. Practicing a sport is healthy. More examples? Mm -hmm. A couple of examples more? Teacher, mm -hmm. can I say driving? Demand, demands, demands uh, attention. All right, very good. That's it. Driving demands, demands. a lot of attention. Is this sentence correct or not correct? It's That's correct, teacher. The question, why is correct? Why? 
because riding is a gerund. The verb is is demand. Ah, very good. No problem. No verb to be. We don't have verb to be, but that's not a problem. You are using the third person in the verb that the sentence has. Very good. Driving demands a lot of attention. Uh, smoking. I don't know. We can use any other verb, but depending on the sentence, you can use a verb to be or verbs in the third person. Correct. So the sentence is correct. Okay, pretty cool, pretty cool. Teacher is sure. is correct. Uh, waking up in mornings is a good practice. Uh, you can add it early to make oh, early. to make it more specific. Yes, Wake waking up, up early, early in the morning. Yes, in the morning. Okay. Yes, was, you... It's a, a good practice. For example. It's a good, it's a good uh, practice or habit. Yeah. Or habit. Okay. Or habit. Waking up early. Okay. Very good. Yes. It is correct. Check. Jeron as the subject of the sentence. Uh, in the verb to be is in this position, but no problem. It's correct. Very good. Teacher. Yeah, it is correct. Yes. Teacher, yeah. another example can be uh, knowing knowing how to drive is important in the life. How to drive is is important in life. In life. Okay, let's check. Let's check it out. Knowing how to drive is, is, ah, is. okay. Yeah, I I missed the verb to be. Yeah, it is correct because the verb the base form is no plus ing. Knowing is the this the subject of the sentence. Correct. Knowing how to drive verb to be. It is correct in singular. Okay. Thank you, teacher. All right. Singular, singular, and singular in this verb. It is correct. Okay. Pretty cool. Good examples. Good examples. Okay. Let's see the next part because we have another part besides this. The next part is kind of similar, but with small differences. Gerunds as objects. Objects. Gerunds as objects. Okay, the previous one was subject. This one is object. Let's see. What is the gerund? Mm -hmm. The gerund. How about the picture is yelling, yelling, like shouting. Similar like shouting. Okay, what is the structure for this? Uh, can you read it, uh, Jorge? Gerunds as object, a structure, any subject. Okay. Plus verb. Plus verb. Plus gerun, uh, plus complement. Plus complement, very good. Let's see. Ah, you can use any subject? Yes, you can use any subject. Examples? I, I he, she. he, she. Okay, in this in this part we have only three. Okay, the verb. Enjoy. For example, enjoy. Next. Mm -hmm. The gerund. Going. 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 And we need a complement to finish the sentence. To the movies. Correct. Check. I enjoy going to the movies he 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 enjoys yes we need the rule in this case because you are using he he enjoys going to the movies. going to the movies <laughs> or she she enjoys going to the movies check 
gerunds as objects, you need the subject in the first place. Different, right? Like the gerund as subject. Okay. Let's continue and check. What is the sentence example in this part? Can you read it? Look. Like, look like look. playing video games. Correct. Look like playing video games. What is the subject? Look. Look. What is the normal verb? Like. Like. But with the third person. Remember? Third person. Yes. Correct. What is the gerund? Playing. Playing. And at the end, I need? The complement. I need a complement. Correct. That's it. Okay. Guys, because of the time, we are going to finish this, um, this mini topic to, in tomorrow class. We don't have a lot, just more examples about this. But if you check, the class is already uploaded in the Google Drive. You can download it. You can review it. And uh, tomorrow we are going to finish with it. All right? Okay. okay. Hey, teacher. All right. Yes, I got. Okay, perfect, perfect, guys. Hey, teacher. Uh, because of the time, sorry. We are going to stop in this moment. And we continue tomorrow, Thursday, to finish this class and continue with class number four of the week. Okay, hey, thank you, All thank right. you, teacher. Thank teacher. You. All right. Yeah. Good class. Tell Maybe. Me, Tell me, yes. Maybe can you send the uh, uh, the drive? Ah, uh, the link. The, the link, uh huh, in ah, the okay. WhatsApp. Uh, WhatsApp. Okay, I will I will send it to you in in this chat and in WhatsApp. Okay, but once you receive, okay. once yeah. you receive it, save Maybe. it. Una vez lo reciba, guárdelo. The book. Because we you receive many messages in WhatsApp and then hey, where is the link? Where is the link? I don't see it. Okay. But I will send it. Okay. Oh, thank you. Okay. There is in, in this thank chat you, as well. Okay, not a problem. Not a problem, guys. Thank you. Teacher, teacher. see you tomorrow. Excuse yeah. me, teacher. Yes. Julio. Uh, uh please revi revise the book. All the answer are are so solves. Ah, you are mean solved. in the platform? No, uh, the uh, manual, el, el manual. Ah, okay. You mean that all answers are done already? Yeah. Ah, okay. Okay, I'm going to check on that. Thank I'm you. Gonna, I'm going to check on that. All right. Okay, no problem, Julio. Thanks uh, for telling me. Okay, guys. Um, See you tomorrow. Yeah, sure. See you, See you tomorrow, tomorrow, guys. Take care. Bye. Tomorrow. Thank, you. Thank you. Thank you for your participation as well. See you. See you tomorrow. See you. Bye-bye.